Yo, what's up guys? Chase the Bro here, and welcome to part 5 of the level through PvP only series. In the previous video, we defeated the Dragon Kin Soldier, and we got the Dragon Halberd, which I do want to upgrade, so hopefully in this first invasion we get enough souls to upgrade it. As for the travel plans for the playthrough, I don't really know exactly where I want to go first, although I did mark a few things I want to get. I want the Spear Talisman, we can get the Two Finger Heirloom so we can gain faith for our Bestial Vitality when we get it. I also thought it might be a really good idea to run down and get the Wet Blade so we can have access to Fire and Flame Art infusions if we want them throughout the playthrough. So that's the base plan for today. Also, yes, this bug did try to attack me, and I'm going to loot him. <laughs> now I wipe my souls, and then we just jump right into our first invasion. Oh, Raya Lucaria! Okay, I'm all for this. Heir of Dragons. Hello, Goblin. How are you? Um. Oh, I still had my iframes. I think I would have got hit there, if not. <laughs> I love how quickly it poisons once you actually use the attack. Uh, I think the Ho should probably jump in here at some point, right? No? Ah, I should have known with a name like that, although... I missed the door. <laughs> hey! Whee! Hi, guys. Oh, there goes Goblin! <laughs> Air of Dragons, what do you have for me? We're gonna, you know what, we're gonna use the Lance. We haven't really used this at all yet. Oh! <laughs> I don't know why I didn't expect that at all. Whoa. Whoa. The possible roll catch change with this. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. I feel like Storm Assault's a good one. And we get the finish. Goodbye, Heir of Dragons. I should have expected Dragon Breath with that name, but <laughs> I just I never expect them to have it at this level. Sadly, that's not really enough souls to either upgrade my weapon or upgrade myself, so we're gonna go for another one. You've come back for round two, huh? <laughs> Stormvale Castle. Always a fan favorite for me. Shiatari. Ooh. Oh, I see a dude with lances over there. Hello there. Hello, guys. How are you? What do we have going on here? We got uh, Shiaria. And then we got uh, a greatsword user. Whoa! Hit him with that. I don't know how good the poison buildup will be. Probably pretty decent though. Dual Lance is an interesting choice. <laughs> oh, we got one poisoned. I don't know how strong the host is really going to be. That setup is powerful, but... We got rid of the poison. Ooh, dual katanas. That could be something. I think he'll jump down. <laughs> I think they're going to sit up top, and I don't know what the fastest way for me to get back up there is, to be honest. Over here? Oh, they're there. Hi, guys. I don't know if they know I exist right here. It'll be a funny surprise, though. Hi there, Katana lad. Coming in hot. <laughs> One done. I wonder how many souls he will give. Dual Katanas is something, you know? Oh, birdie. Can birdie hurt me? Okay, not over leveled, actually. Comboed with the bird, though. How about that one? Was that one slightly over leveled? Maybe. No! You guys are all proper levels. <laughs> I think that's what's gonna happen here. Oh my god, unless the giant just stops them. Goodbye, dual lance guy. <laughs> we got a few souls out of that. I'll take it. Oh wait, I just realized this is a somber smithing stone weapon. I honestly don't know the cost of upgrading it. We can, since it's a somber. We'll go to somber one. Perfect. Okay, now we can move on to our travel plans. What do we want to grab first? So I think I'm going to go get the greatsword. I want to see if we have the weight load for it. And then we can fight the tree avatar and get the tier that way that I want. I'm really wondering what the weight load is going to be like. Maybe I will be light enough for it. That'd be pretty cool. Oh, there's a lot of doggos around here. This is dangerous. <laughs> Great sword acquired, though. Ha <laughs> ha. Now, this one's a demon. I'm actually going to use a prawn to have better defense against it. What do I think would be the weakness? We could probably still frostbite, to be honest. I just need to be careful with this. And always roll to the side so we don't get scarlet rotted. Because that would be awful. Let's try this. How's the blessed damage? Not very good is the answer. Hmm, what about this? Oops. 
I forgot I can't one-hand it, so I have to, like, confirm that I know I can't one-hand it. I could probably poison it as well. Otherwise, the damage on this is going to be destructive for us. Excuse me. <laughs> Are you poisoned yet? No! I guess it is like a Scarlet Rot tree. Can we even poison it? Oh, that's gonna hurt, yeah. We really can't be taking any damage at all. <laughs> or else we're gonna get one shot. I think my best bet is probably to stick with the Frostbite, I suppose. Do I have time to get in there? Yes! Doesn't seem like we're gonna get a Frostbite proc, so. Or sorry, a poison one. Frostbite worked. I like that they like to do this attack over and over again. Fairly simple to dodge. I don't enjoy this attack though. I have to run always horizontal, and there's always some weird thing in the way. And I swear they did that on purpose with the map. <laughs> Not gonna do the overhead dunk. Alright, we got Frostbite proc. I like that. I could always reset it with the fire, actually, to make this quicker. And on top of that, fire does pretty good damage. <laughs> We're a fire and ice build. I like it. Maybe we can get the frostbite during this. I don't think so. FP needed, though. Woo! Oh. Awkward angle. You know, we're doing so well, I feel like I want to stay full health here. <laughs> Just in case we get one shot by the butt slam. Which I feel like could happen. Woo! Good thing that has fast recovery. I did not expect that at all. Let's start over this way so we can sprint this way. We know there's free no cover over there. Ugh. Oh nice, actually this could be the end. Oh wow. Fully charged heavy maybe? Yeah, perfect. Alright, tree down. There's a grace nearby as well. Yeah, the opaline hard tier. One of my favorites. I use this quite often. There's a grace down there and we could use the horsey jump, so we're gonna do that. Get in here really quickly. And we get another memory stone. I'm all for that. There's some incantations I've been having fun with. Then we get the grace. Perfect. Now let's fix up our physic. I think I just want opaline and regen for now. I feel like that's a good one. Next up, we have the wet blade that I want to grab. That is quite a long horsey ride. But for you guys, it's going to be pretty instant. I'm pretty sure Flaming Strike is on the outside, and then the actual Wet Blade is on- Oh boy! <laughs> I thought I could animate jump it. Sorry, horsey. That's my bad. I'm gonna have to just time the dodges. <laughs> oh, actually. We can still get back on our- Oh boy. Ah! <laughs> run, Torrent, run! We're under fire! <laughs> oh boy! I think every time I've come here, it's actually been the Radon Festival. This is kind of a first for me. <laughs> there you are, Flaming Strike. Perfect. I remember, is that a knight near here? No, it was a bat. Now we could have a fire-infused weapon. This will be really good for our strength build. I think you can kind of roll catch the bats. You just stagger the elements. Well, that one didn't move. What about this? Can you backstab them when they're down like this? Well, guess that would have been a front stab, but you know. Runes and butterflies. Okay. Now, if I remember correctly, which I don't always, it's over there, right? Yeah. Woo! We're going to roll off here. Let's just get some regen going through this area. I remember dogs being quite a nuisance. Ooh, 
then a knight in my butt. Jesus. Oh yeah. Lion's broad. You're the dex version of my current sword. I'm the strength version. Oh my god, I got it! Okay. We're kind of set up if I swap to a dex build halfway through. I don't know where that kind of luck was with my Banished Knight Greatsword. That would have been appreciated. These have the headband that I like, I'm pretty sure. So, Commoner Shoes. Could I get your headband? Ow. Nothing. That is unfortunate. Most of my playthroughs, because I come here when the Radon Festival is going on, I can't grab this. <laughs> it's so much pain. Oh, there, knight. I think that's all I really want from here for now. I just wanted to get a few early things. That way we can use them quickly. Now we can either get the two-finger heirloom or the spear talisman. They're honestly both useful. Uh, maybe I'll go for spear talisman first, though. All right, we're quickly going to decide on our Ash of Wars. I feel like Flaming Strike I should throw on, like I said, probably the Claymore. We don't need too long range. I have Stormblade and I have Blessed Weapon. So I feel like that's that's pretty good. This is a good chase down weapon in general. This is a tough one. The Heavy Thrusting Sword would be good poison as well because you chase them down so you get a lot of hits easily. The Zweihander is going to have a really high poison buildup. So maybe I'll, I'll try Zweihander quick. If I don't like the way it works, I'll throw it on our Heavy Thrusting Sword. Definitely makes its damage weaker overall. So we'll see how I like this. We'll try fire though. This is different. But I'll probably make the claymore very strong. This loadout's very good for now though. We will try an invasion. See if we can get an overleveled phantom to level us up. I really want the 22 strength for the dragon halberd. Demetrius and Denji. Hello guys. I've never had a fight in there. Can we go in there while I'm here? No, I didn't think so. Hi there. Oh my god, a heavy rolling... Melania. Um, that's interesting. Let's just eat some of our prawn. Ow, sir. I'm gonna hit your strong phantom because he looks like he's gonna give me a lot of souls. <laughs> Holding a bunch of katanas, has the endgame greatsword. Gotta love that he's still rolling. Stop it! Host, go. Leave. Leave me to my banquet. Oh, perfect. I need those souls. I'm sorry, Denji, but I needed to do that. That looks like it's going to be a feast. Oh, yeah. 39,000. I like it. Okay. Let's do this. Oh, catch flame, huh? Poke, poke. That has 85 frostbite buildup. Well, we can definitely get our levels with this. <laughs> All right, so now we're level 26. We have 22 strength, and I did spend the rest of the souls on prawns. Now we can move on to grabbing the spear talisman. I don't really know what grace is the closest, but we can take the scenic isle, I guess, from patches, or maybe here. I forget, honestly, exactly where the cave is. I realize that I haven't been to the village here yet either. We may as well unlock this. This is a really good possible invasion spot. We get the grace. I'll go grab the medallion really quick. I guess we fight the perfumer first. R1 spam. Oh. Ow. That hurt. Hello there. <laughs> hear me. How did someone die talking to him? Oh, the perfumer. <laughs> yeah. Wait then. Well, oh, I will finish. The curse might beg you. You must keep. Ooh, perfect. The medallion. I suppose we go fight the boss while we're here, and then we can try an invasion. See if we get one in this area. Wizard, you dare target my horse? Isn't there some dogs in here? Can you backstab him? Oh my god, you can! Oh, that makes this a lot better. And you can kind of stun him. I'm gonna do this just so we have better defense. Not to mention, dogs will kind of like pick away at us during the fight, so. Hi there. Can we stun you with jump attacks? Kinda. Yeah, the greatsword does just stun him. That's pretty cool. Oh. Did not expect that, though. I'm gonna be honest with you. Ooh. A little on the terrifying side. One, two, three. 
He's over here? Yeah. <laughs> Weird aiming that, I have to say. Perfect. Any items over here? I don't really remember. There is a dog. Reduces damage and impacts of headshots. I don't think I've ever used that talisman. <laughs> Interesting, though. And a rune arc. All right, then let's just wipe our souls and then we'll go for an invasion. Uh, I guess this counts as nearby only. <laughs> I wonder how far nearby is then. Am I over the village? I can't open my map right now. Greg! Oh, oh. You guys are ganking that. Oh my god, look at that. Look at that beast. Hello. Soulless spaghetti. Oh my god, you're gonna give me tons of souls. Oh yes. Yes. <laughs> Thank you for the assist, boss. He was looking tanky. Alright, Greg. I don't even care if you finish the boss. Oh, well, that, I got that backstab. Okay, well. I'm pretty sure the boss can hit me as well. Don't hit me out of the air, boss, please. I'm in the danger zone. You don't want to stand between the host and his boss. I'm sorry I'm vicious, Greg. I want these souls. <laughs> Greg, you should come this way. <laughs> should probably heal. You know, we'll let the boss do it. Or maybe Greg can resummon that phantom. I want you to get him. Maybe if we poison Greg, he will feel more inclined to do so. Oops. Yeah, Greg's poison. Perfect. Should probably... Okay, well, I think Greg's all in on this. <laughs> okay. He doesn't seem like the resummoning type, to be honest, so I don't think we're going to get a, a feast out of him. I think the poison's <laughs> going to get him. Well, goodbye, Greg. I'm sorry I ambushed your phantom, but he was a good amount of runes for me. All right, now we have some more souls, and the question is, do I want to level up a bit more, or do we want to get our weapons to plus four? I feel like plus four might be fine for Liurnia. Most people will have a plus one weapon by here, and we'll probably still invade Limgrave quite often. So I'm really debating if we use the souls to upgrade some of our better weapons to four. Yeah, I think we're going to take a look and see how many weapons we can get to plus four with the souls we have, and then I'll decide if I want to do that. Oh. I forgot this happens. <laughs> Actually, I'm just never sure when it happens. Well, hello there, Ensha. Let's um, make sure we get rid of you. Whoa. Perfect. <laughs> That's unexpected. What triggers this? Getting that medallion? I don't really know. The Clinging Bone. Well, you know, NPC invaded me. That's kind of PvP. I'll make sure I keep like 200 souls extra though because that's what it gave me. So, to not feel like cheating. Alright, well we definitely upgrade our Banished Knight Greatsword. We use that quite often. Claymore as well. The Great Ape, the Zweihander, and what else? Oh, okay, the Scimitar I haven't been using a lot the past couple battles, but it is a good one to have. And then, you know, the dagger should be a good one. I haven't used it a lot, but it is nice to have that upgraded. That's really it. I'll buy a few stones, leave that couple hundred. Oh, yeah, what is this? Ooh, the royal remains greaves. I forgot about that. Free armor. It's not very pretty. <laughs> I think I'll keep my head. I think at this point we're going to end up using more of these. Oh, wow. I could buy two. There, there's the extra 300 that I might have got from him fighting me. Now we go for the Spear Talisman. Still don't know what's closer to go from, but we'll go from here. There you are. That took a little while for me to find. I forgot where this one was. We turn on our lantern now that we've entered the cave. Open this chest as well. Arteria leaf. Ah, yes. The most precious... Look at you hiding in the bushes. Wow. Fire is going to work out well against them. Whee! Yeah, fire is great. One-shotting them it feels good. Any more in the bush? No. Okay. Oh! 
Oh, how convenient that we have a fire weapon, actually. Ooh, you know what? Weapon. I'm standing on water. That made that a little worse, but you know. Oh, I guess they weren't on water, but I was. What the? Open up for me. Thank you, thank you. And then we get our spear talisman. I don't know if I want to use that more or the claw talisman. I know the claw talisman kind of got nerfed, but by meaning the jump attack combo, it's still something. Oh, yes. Hello, Bloodhound Knight. Pretty anime dodge you got going on there. Whoa. What if I jumped? It wouldn't matter too much. <laughs> oh, damn. I mean, you both do damage and take a lot of damage. That's fine. Aren't you? Oh, but you do a lot of bleed. Woo! Woo! I'm going to do this. Alright, now we're tankier. I love that we hit through that. <laughs> I feel like that's a good attack to punish. Although he recovers from it pretty quick. And he does use it a lot. Oh, are they shooting stuff at me through the fog wall? That's funny. Whoa. Nice. Goodbye, Bloodhound Knight. You're still scary, though. We get the wizard medallion. <laughs> Who has more FP than their flask can ever regenerate? Not me. Oh, hello there. I told thee that I was more happy because my other. Oh, so. What is this? Oh, rune arc. <laughs> I feel like I found a few of those randomly. All right, that's done. I suppose we'll just start going up this way. But of course, we're gonna do our invasion first. Let's just warp to the right area, though. All right, let's go for a wipe, and we do our invasion, and then we head to get the two finger heirloom and whatever else is in that area. Oh, Grail's Dragon Barrow. See, this is why it's kind of cool to run around everywhere. Hello there, Nero. Where are we running to, by the way? I'm a little confused. Hello, Nero. Hello. Can we just talk about how the phantoms leave the host behind? Like, look at this. <laughs> look at this. I don't know if they're trying to lead him to safety, but one should be behind him. If you guys are trying to protect him, this is <laughs> this is an interesting way of doing it. Hello there. Stop leaving him behind. I don't want to hit him. <laughs> this is so you have the guts, great sword. You have to be the brave one, all right? It's up to dragon breath. Oh. You ran into an alley of dragons. I just realized that. What was the plan? Oh my god. What is the plan? <laughs> well, we'll take those souls. 495, really? Huh. Hello there. You lost one teammate. What about... You know, we haven't done much parrying. This could be fun. Hi there. Plus a dual katana user, they're definitely going to get parried, right? I would prefer you, um, I want you to back up specifically. Could, could you, could you let your, uh, high level phantom do, or, you know, the rivers of blood user, could you let him do the work? <laughs> Smack. You have to preemptively do it? No. Poke, poke. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Maybe we can get a backstab chain here. Oh, I got the weird little pivot, or we would have. Unfortunate. <laughs> we'll let our regen do a little bit of work here. Oh, I was gonna say, I knew he was gonna attack, but maybe our connection's very good. I wanna, like, hit him. Perhaps we go for the phantom kill right away instead of going for parries. I don't want to kill the host. We'll get rid of the phantom. There we go. Now we can have some fun. <laughs> All right, Nero. Phantom down. Backstab. Backstab. Now, heal yourself, maybe. 
Or go for an all-out swing fest. Oh. The third one. Poke. <laughs> okay. He really didn't want to get parried. Goodbye, Nero. It was a fun fight, though. And I do appreciate all the souls you've given me. Alright, I think that's enough for one level. Levels are going to get more expensive as time goes on. This will be interesting to see how often I could even get a level. I still want a little bit more health, though. The tankier, the better right now, since weapon scaling isn't the best with this level of weapon anyway. Alright, let's head up and grab the two-finger heirloom. I think there's a Knight Rider up there as well. I realized I haven't been fighting the Knight Riders. Alright, horsey, we got this. Nice. I have to make a nightfall so we can fight the boss. Mr. Boss, you who Can I poison him? I think I can. Oh, that was a good turn of events. The horse is poisoned. Interesting. But he's not. Oh no, the boss is poisoned. <laughs> I don't know why I thought that. I just seen the health bar on the horse it looked like. Oh, that stunned me. I didn't think that was going to hit me at all. Better defense is appreciated here. Hello. Kind of dragging me in weird ways. Stomp. Right. Woo! Kind of stuck in an awkward corner there with that wall. Yeah, I like that attack. Gives you a long punish window. Frostbite. Nice. We can reset it with the uh, flaming strike as well. May as well buff our sword. Perfect. Crit. There we go. And then R2. Blood Ash of War. Ah, Ice Spear. That's right. Okay. Hello, Mr. Giant. I'll be running by you. I don't remember what weapon this is, and I'm really curious. Oh, the tree spear. Ooh, that would be hard to use right now. I think it has more decks than we require. 22 and 18 faith. Into the cave we go. I also realized we fought a boss, and then we didn't do our invasion, so we're going to wipe and do our invasion. Oh, we're right near where we are, right? Yeah. Oh, wait, no, we're not. We're near the beginning of Lyurnia. Ooh, let's put on the Spear Talisman. I want to try it out. Oh, you got a teammate. Hello there. Oh, you got lucky enough to get the helm. I got, like, everything but the helm. <laughs> and I got the greatsword last. Oh, man, you don't have health. I see we've invested in... I don't know what we've invested in. <laughs> Whee. Definitely not health, though. I know what that wizard invested in. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Hang on a second here. I want to strategically use our buff. <laughs> there we go. Now we can kind of ignore the wizard. Wait, which one's the host? I'm hoping it's not the wizard. Wizard! I don't want to hit your host. Oh, he's got a bleed straight sword. That could be why as well. Whoa. All right, wizard down. Hoping that wasn't the... You know what we can probably do? I'm going to guess he's going <laughs> to... Because then we could do set of fairies here. Although, hey, the bleed comes up pretty quick for him. Not very damaging unless he gets the bleed proc. But it would bleed me in four hits. Oof. <laughs> we'll give him a bow, though. Not really enough souls. So that was more of just an invasion for fun, I guess. Those souls aren't really going to do much for us, so we'll just go through the cave area. And then we hope we get a higher level phantom in the next one. Wait, is this one of the catacombs that has a secret area below? No. My favorite. <laughs> I hate these so much. They honestly still will always do a lot of damage. All their throwables. I hear another one behind me, I swear. Stop your backing away. Oh my god, you know what would be my favorite weapon against these guys? No, this isn't really what I wanted, but... Oh yeah. This. 
just throw some wind at them every two seconds when we need to. I do want to get one more death root so we can get our regen. That would just be so optimal. Oh! The fourth great sword. Wasn't expecting that. I forgot they have that. Oh, wow. They're tanky. Oh, okay. Trying to ambush me, huh? Okay, pretty good dodge in the middle of my R1 stamp. Spam. Stam. <laughs> oh my god, I couldn't speak there. I do have one of these. We can buy more as well. I don't know what's in here. Definitely one of those, though. What is this? The Nox Mirror Helm. Ooh, item. Oh god, trap. I'm gonna dodge you. Dodge you, maybe. Oh no, we're definitely gonna get out here really quickly. Use the trap to hit them. There's a lot of them in there. We'll use the trap again. Definitely using that to our advantage. Ooh, the scythe. Okay. I see, I see. Not a bad item. Where do I go from here, though? Down or across? This guy's throwing something. Oh, item down there. That, oh, we're definitely going to be doing this, though. This is terrifying. Oh, push. Corner is not good. Okay, we're good. Oh, wait, 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 wait. There's a flower here. Oh, man. Oh, that hurt. Ow. You guys are the worst. Let me clear you. There we go. All right, now where do we go? Down that way? We drink our physic flask for regen, because I don't know what's to come after this, to be honest. I guess we can go all the way down. This is definitely one of the more confusing catacombs. This looks like a fog wall. Sorry, this looks like an illusory wall. Nope, okay. I thought it might be. You guys are so tanky, but I can backstab you sometimes, and that saves me a lot of pain. Still alive? Jeez. Okay. Ah, yes. Okay, well, we're gonna backstab you. <laughs> Sit back down, and when you get up, we flaming strike you into jump attack. Oh! Or. Or you destroy me. How long is that attack chain? What is this? The page ashes. All right. Well, here's the <laughs> here's the sneak attack. Here's the lever. There we go. What's this? An old fang. All right. All right. Now into the boss we go. I don't know what to expect. They're usually all kind of the same boss, but. I don't know what this one is, yeah. <laughs> a watchdog. Oh, but it's the wizard watchdog. So kind of unique. Sort of. Oh boy. Can we poison them? I think so. Poison just makes a lot of fights go faster. That's a weird one. Woo. Wizard pews. Alright, we heal. Oh my god. That catches me so off guard. It's so oddly timed compared to the other one. Oh, there we go. I was going to say, when do we get a crit? Oh, well, I missed it, because I was greedy. It's my own fault. What about Frostbite? Think that'll work? No? Okay, well, I don't think we got a stat proc, but boss down. All right, now we can head over, get the two-finger heirloom, but first we do our wipe and we invade.
Ooh, Raya Lucaria. Okay, so I'm getting more invasions here now. I'm closer to the correct level for here. Slamurai! Hello! Hello there! That looks like a organized group. And we're gonna be tanky, aren't we? We got a bow. Oh boy. Some Mac! I missed. Okay, maybe maybe he'll open the door for us. Maybe? Slamurai! It's interesting that there's a, a bow user. <laughs> we got Slamurai and Mr. Great Bow. That'll be different. I kind of want to not get slammed by Slamurai. Ooh! Light Bow, huh? Not the most damaging. Oh! Piercing Fang on the Nagi. That's cool. You don't see that all the time. Alright, let's get them poisoned then. Smack! Oh! Oh, jeez! That was a good combo together. <laughs> Whee. We hit Slamurai. I want to get Slamurai poisoned. Perfect. Oh, no, no. Why? See, why are the hosts the most aggressive? Hi, guys. <laughs> why, why did neither of you guys fight first? That could have been a war. <laughs> Unfortunate. Alright, since that invasion didn't really have any high-level phantoms that we killed, we may as well just head towards grabbing the two-finger heirloom. Whoa, there's a lot of enemies here. Bam. Excuse me, guys. I didn't expect you to attack me. And a dog. That's me. L2. This one's a survivor. They are coming out of nowhere. Alright, what do we have here? The Cuckoo Glenstone. Yes, this hidden area. This one's actually really hidden. The Shabriri Grape. And we have our two finger heirloom. Now we can use it to cast regen, but now I need a death root. There was a survivor dog, wasn't there? All right. Now one thing has been bothering me. I want to go collect this map. Every time I open it to search for areas I want to go to next, I just see this. So we're gonna go get this and the closest grace is probably this. We're just gonna horse here around the side. Oh, what's this? Ooh, the jelly shield, ow. Now, what do you have in here? Some enemies, but some items for me to steal. I'll take that rune arc. Oh no, not my horse. No, actually not my health. The horse is fine. <laughs> now we could kill them all or use our superior dodging to lead them in a circle and open this. Excuse me. I'll take this glimstone. <laughs> no, don't crack the wizard. Uh, oh wow, I ducked it with my attack. Excuse me, sir. I want this chest. Oh, there's two chests here. Okay, I'll kill you. Then. What do we got? We got a smithing stone four. And we got an Aldenorg blood clot. Oh, that's right. The carriage has the carrion straight sword. I could grab it, but I don't plan to use it anytime soon, to be honest. It doesn't hurt to pick up, though. The Carrion Night Sword. Nice, we get the grace and then we can finally get the map. Since we're right nearby, we may as well head towards Carrion Manor. Also, we can talk to EG, see what stones EG has. Oh, that's right, this place has the hidden underground area. Is there a boss here? I don't remember a boss. Oh no, not the Revenant. <laughs> How can one forget about the Revenant? Oh dear. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Okay, we heal that. I forgot how far the Revenant can jump gaps. 
<laughs> okay, you need to get frostbitten, my good sir. Oh, we we do this. Higher defense over time would help a lot. Oh, we're poisoned. Okay, that's fine. I don't think we're gonna have time to do a heal here. We're just gonna have to face tank and trade. This thing is actually crazy. It's out here Dragon Ball Z fighting. Oh my god. <laughs> I was just hyper armor trading that. <laughs> we are going to heal the poison though. That sounds like a good idea. There wouldn't have been much time to do this in the fight. What are you protecting? The frozen needle. For more of a dexterity kind of quality weapon, I guess. Why, hello, EG. Alright, so we get Somber 1, 2, 3, and 4. Although, 3 and 4 are limited, but we have unlimited 2s from him. That's kind of nice. When I get some souls, maybe we'll buy some of these, because I currently don't have many Somber stones. Now I think I'm going to wipe my souls, go for an invasion. I do want to see if we can get any souls for the <laughs> Somber Smithing Stones. <laughs> I meant to use this, not the horse. <laughs> Into the academy we go. I love getting invasions here. I feel like it's one of the areas I don't get to PvP often in. Surprise! <laughs> Alright, let's get our boost going before we start fighting this. I don't know how many there are. The Phantom here doesn't look super high level, so that's kind of sad. I don't think we're going to get enough souls off the Phantom. Not overleveled at all, actually. Very, very low defense. Why are we not hitting me? Well, there goes the host. Unfortunate. <laughs> 200 souls. Okay, we'll do another. The beginning of Limgrave. Jeez. I guess you could farm up here. Maybe I'm a little low for the area. I've seen comments saying a lot of people were 40 in Liernia. What am I right now? We're 27. So that's a possibility. Alone. Maybe you're a Taunter Tongue Warrior going through the game. I could see it. That's something. Poison! Woo! We haven't used the Sham Shear in a while. Maybe we'll go for the bleed through that shield. <laughs> yeah. Especially if you don't have armor on. The fashion is cute, though. A lone host, though. They had to have been Taunter Tongue, right? Yeah, because... It's not like something in this open world here would have killed their phantom. We'll go for one final one. If we don't manage to get a high level phantom, we'll just call it and go into the manor. Stormvale. A lot of people summon their friends here, so we can hope. Let's start it with our initial poison. It's always best to do that. Let's see, they're all by the grace, huh? They go up the elevator. No, you left me behind. Oh, well. Hi, guys. I want to test this out. Wait, Cave Boy doesn't look... They're all... They all don't look like overleveled phantoms, unfortunate. <laughs> nice jump, man. <laughs> oh my god. Against a naked enemy. <laughs> Instant frost bit. <laughs> oh, that's terrifying. Okay, that's... No, that's not the worst damage. It's just, I feel like at this level, stat procs are definitely the most effective. A team can blender you, though, with physical hits. Oh, wait, I don't want to kill your host. Whoa. You're telling me your host has no no flasks left already. Just none. Yeah, look at that. Cave boy got poisoned at once. That's not good. You want some armor. We'll let the poison do its work. <laughs> or the frostbite. You know what I've always wanted to test? Can we parry the second hit of a Curved Greatsword? Do it. Do it. No, he was smart. Oh, ow, you hit. Oh, man, okay. <laughs> Don't run away. Don't use the crit as time to escape me. That's really funny. All right, well. Goodbye, Plin Plin Plon. You know what? I like you. <laughs> that was a strategy right there. Quick, while he's down, go. 
<laughs> well, we most certainly don't have enough to level up, so we'll see if we can buy a stone or two with what we have. <laughs> Can't even buy one. Oh, all right, we'll just go into the manor. You know what would be good here? Our fire weapon for all the hands. Someone jump down the second you cross. You sneaky hand. Oh wow, there's two. Oh boy, two at once. Didn't even know that. Or well, I guess I didn't remember it. Stop it! I will burn you. This one must be the mama hand, because it's stronger. Ow. <laughs> burn fingers. Oh, that's not okay. <laughs> Wait, the other one's not dead? I could have sworn. Okay. Ah, ah! In the back of the hand. That's right. That's where you burn. I see him crawling back there. I thought he was dead. Oh, wait. They drop... Oh, yeah. They drop stones, don't they? Somber Smithing Stone 2, to be exact. I didn't grab that one either. Do they always drop that? Or is it a chance they drop it? Hello there, big hand. Flame on. <laughs> Let's see if this one drops a stone as well. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, you know what? When we get to the next race, we'll do some more invasions. I kind of want to try to upgrade our weapons to be in the right range. I'm pretty sure you get some Ash of Wars here as well. I remember the Ice One Horfrost Stomp is in here somewhere. We get the grace. Oh yeah, there is an NPC above there as well. That's right. All right, let's wipe and we hope we get a high level phantom because I both want to level up my soul level and get the weapon upgrades. Stormgate. Yeah, because then maybe we'd be invading Lyurnia a lot more. But I honestly feel like I fight a lot of people that have higher level phantoms in this area anyway too. A bow user. Hello. <laughs> Hello. You don't look like you're going to have a lot of souls, sadly. Poison! We, on the people that run away, I like to poison them because, well... Damage over time, exactly. There we go. Hello there. Don't poke me. Ooh, that was a pretty good backstab. Well, they have Bloody Slash. So he's got a bleed thrusting sword. <laughs> oh, getting rid of the Phantom first if it's the last thing I do. <laughs> this is a really awkward place to fight. <laughs> it's like, get off me! Phew! Well, I could have probably did the thrust attack right there. No, I want the phantom. Oh, that's some bleed coming in hot. Oh, no! Please! No! I want the souls! <laughs> I don't want the little bit of souls. We got a mission cut out for ourselves here. Some Storm Hill action with Salmon. Just salmon. Hello, salmon. What the? Salmon, you can't be alone, right? You have to have one. Oh, you have a partner. Oh, you have, you have two partners, I think. Maybe. Twin blade. Oh, he doesn't look high level either. <laughs> you guys are all just playing the appropriate level today, apparently. Where's the bull goats? <laughs> I need me some bull goats. <laughs> what is this? You know, we're slowly leveling this way, though. Like, it's not worthless. <laughs> if we get a few weapon upgrades out of it. It's something on our mission. Um, Seems like he's going to run a little bit. Oh, good dodges, though. Oh, he has tactics here. He wasn't ready for that, though. There's a barrel behind you, my friend. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm sorry. But I must acquire the runes. Hey, that's 750. Oh, nice. I tried nearby only. Maybe that'll give us more higher level players. Ooh, blood flame. Hello there. Hi, guys. I see you have a twin blade. What do we want to try? I was going to use the claws. Because they have a true combo and I haven't been using them a lot. Oh, no! I didn't think he'd die from that. Oh, please give me those. Please. 
it was fast enough, I swear. No. No. Well, I didn't think the host was going to die. Ooh, right, Lucaria. Tom. All right, people always have some beefy phantoms in here, right? Come on, Tom. Oh, they're behind me. Hello. Ooh, that looks like a high-level phantom. Hello there. Ooh, is that a moon veil? <laughs> some scarlet rod attempts. Oh! God damn! <laughs> I didn't think the hitbox was going to be that good on that. Okay. This is what I'm looking for. Yes, Rayla. Yes. The moon veil is strong enough, but you know. Nice. You look like you just tank through phantoms. Perfect. No, host. I don't want you. Okay, well, maybe I want you. That's a moon veil. <laughs> maybe you're good enough to take down. This is what I want to see. What's that? No, that'll hurt me. Hi, guys. Sheath that sword, my friend. Dragon breath. Oh, oh god. All right, we're kind of on a time limit now. We got to kill them. Whoop. That was a nice dodge. I got to heal that. <laughs> the host needs to go. That hit me? Oh god. It wasn't even near me though. No. No. I'm pretty boned then to be honest. Actually I can use a warming stone. Oh my god if we can get rid of the scarlet rot by just using a warming stone and countering. We're good to go. We dodge. We dodge. Gotta play it patiently. Tom, go away. Tom, go away. I need your phantom, not you. Why is Tom protecting the fan the overleveled phantom? Can we talk about that? <laughs> Tom, you need to go back. You need to fall back, Tom. Fall back. Back. Yes, this is what I want. Tom, fall back, please. For the love of God. Tom, go. <laughs> Tom, no! Ah, uh, Tom! <laughs> Why are the hosts more aggressive than the, like, the high-level phantoms? Oh, that's the worst. Tom? I despise you, Tom. <laughs> we finally found a high-level phantom, and you protected him. <laughs> How dare you, Tom. James, huh? Oh, we have 1,400. <laughs> That's nowhere near what I need, though. Takashi, okay. Why? See, look at this. You? I want him. Yeah, yeah. Come here. Well, actually, you guys both look like you're not super high-level here, but I do want more souls out of the fight, so... <laughs> that was kind of cool. Can we talk about that? <laughs> that pulled me out of the air. I like that. <laughs> okay, we heal. Let's get poison going then. On the phantom. There we go. He's like, this has been working so far. Do you have time to backstab it? <laughs> Not really, but he did an R2, so I did have time. Ooh, okay, you know what? You know what? That's that's good. 3,200. That's something. I'll take that. He wasn't this level. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that's, that's worthwhile. We can at least get a rune level with that. I don't think it would be enough to get all our weapons to five that I use, like these ones. I know it's like 900 sometimes for some of them. So we're going to do a rune level with this chunk. 
There we go, we're level 28, and then we'll continue on in the manor. Smithing stone 4, nice. I took the dead end way, but I got a rune arch. <laughs> oh, there's actually a golden seed here, nice. I would like to get more Estus. Hey, wolf. Go off the cliff, please. Never a fan of fighting wolves. Fire was pretty effective, though. What do you drop? Beast bones. It pays to have a sword of every element. Nice. Parkour. Oh, is this to get behind the troll, I guess? If you want to. Hmm, what would be best against these? They have some good poise. Wanted to see if we can hyper armor that at all. I don't think so. But we can just hard one spam them. <laughs> that works well. Where were you? You're on the other staircase usually. Must have went above. Oh boy. That does a lot of damage actually. The triple one explosive ones in lane are like crazy. What do you drop? Oh, I got your hood. Well, I guess we go fight the boss. There's a third one here? I don't remember the third one, but we'll take you out just for fun. Maybe you'll drop me that crossbow. <laughs> I don't get lucky with loot drops. <laughs> nope. All right. Now tell me, Loretta. Did you get poisoned? <laughs> Find out. Can you poison a ghost? I don't think so, though. I feel like it would have happened by now. <laughs> the buck attack. <laughs> okay, we're gonna give up on poison. I feel like we would have got the poison proc by now, but tell me, Loretta, do you bleed? <laughs> Keep up the attacks no matter what. For science! Okay, I, I don't know. I don't think so. Though. Yeah, no bleed yet. Okay, well. Then. Do you frostbite? <laughs> that second part hits me a lot. You. Don't get me stunned by the horse because of your wizard fuse. Oh! Oh, that's cool. That was majestic. Burn, Loretta. Since I can't freeze you, I'll burn you. No more bucks for you. <laughs> We get Loretta's Great Bow and Loretta's Slash. That could be useful. We don't really have a normal... Oh, we have a Halberd. I think that is where we stop for part five. We finished the boss in the Carrier Manor, but we are going to collect a lot of the Ash of Wars around here. Go to the Three Sisters area. Do some more invasions in the next one, of course, to start off with. Feel free to recommend other things that I haven't picked up in the areas I've been to below. I am going to be doing a cleanup where I go. I know I have to do the Fringe Folk Heroes Grave. I have that marked. There's a couple caves in Liurnia that I still have to do as well. So anything else that you can think of, comment it below. I do appreciate all the input. Until the next video, this is goodbye. I will see you all next time. Thanks so much for watching. Goodbye. Goodbye.